And welcome back everyone to Let's Play Fallout 2. Now, we're in Klamath, we've just killed the uh, rat god. And uh, yeah, we're feeling pretty good about ourselves. We're level 4 now. So we're gonna go to this little place. Uh, let's see, there's nothing here I think. Actually, maybe something. Do you have kids? No, I don't have kids. Bugger off. Why are you following me? Alright, let's go. I think... No, this is not it. Never mind. Oh, that's in... Um, that's in the den. What I'm looking for. Never mind. Never mind me! Is there a quick exit here? No, let's just go over here to the other side of the town. Now, let's see. What's our inventory like? It's okay, I think. Especially with... Uh, with Solik there. So, I think there's another quest somewhere around here. Wait, is it over here? At the Buckners. This guy, I think is this guy, no? This guy, this guy. An older man with a scrangly beard and a big red nose. Howdy, stranger. My name's Whiskey Bob. What's yours? My name is Metal Canyon. Nice to meet you, Whiskey Bob. Always nice to find another drinking buddy. Wanna buy me a drink? Talking always makes me thirsty. Oh, that was that was kind of a mix between uh, Texan and, and British or something. I don't know. Sure, Bob. Don't mind a bit. Uh, hmm, yeah. Thanks for the drink, partner. Now that me my whistles went, I feel that I can share a little problem I have. Hey, maybe you can help me out. How can I help you out? Well, you see, I have a little side business that I need some help attending to. I have a moonshine still outside of town that needs to be fueled up every so often. Since a gecko down my, got down bit my leg, I can't hobble out to it before it runs out of fuel. If I tell you where it is, would you refuel it for me? It's worth $50 to me. That doesn't sound too bad. Tell me more. All you have to do is find a little shag just south of town. Go inside and dump some firewood into the still. Then come back here and I'll give you your money. But it needs to be done within the next day or my batch of hooch will go bad. That sounds pretty easy. Okay, I'll do it. You'll do it? Right. Remember, you gotta do it soon or my hooch will go bad. Thanks a heap. See you back here soon. No problem, Bob. See you in a day. Alright, so... Don't take this mission if you're not gonna do it, because there are geckos there. And I probably shouldn't have taken it, because I'm low on health. So, that was a pretty stupid thing to do, see? But, what we need to do... These are just normal geckos, so that's not too bad. We need to get that shack over there. So let's try to avoid as many as possible. Oh, there's a golden gecko. I don't want to fight that one. That's for sure. I'll fight this one. But they see me from miles away, that's the problem. Let's see, there's a golden gecko right there. Another gecko there. Another golden one there, shit. See, this is not good. I think I'm gonna start using this, because my small guns is now 85, so that should be okay. And it's daylight, ah, oh, I gotta reload. Now how cool is that sound? 84, that's not gonna be good for a critical hit. Eh, let's just shoot. How much? Six damage only. Damn it, damn, damn, damn. Fifteen hot hit points. That's not too bad. That's more what I'm talking about. Now the thing is, um, you see my AC always changing. This also denotes how many AC, you know, NPCs have, and so I think. Anyway, I haven't been watching it. But if you turn if you end your turn with action points to spend they will convert into armor class, so if you have two more hit, uh, two more AC at the end of the turn, you'll get two more AC, so that's pretty good. Let's see if we can do a critical hit. How many hit points? Four hit points, never mind a critical hit, just kill him. There we go. Oh, that's pretty good. Alright, now I'm gonna save this, because this may be a bit dangerous here. Those golden geckos, they suck. I could try sneaking, but my sneak is 22%. I don't see that going anywhere, and it's, it's daylight as well, so, you know. 10 hit points, that's not too bad. Oh, another gecko coming. Another gecko coming. 
Oh, it's gonna get interesting now. Whoa! Nice! Come on, geckos. Come and get me. I'm an angry farmer. Get off my lawn. Oh, wait. I have no lawn here. It's just bloody desert. No, that's not what they would say, bloody. That's a damn desert. Bang! Nice. Well, let's get a little weight. Nope, nope. I could try it. And, oh no, the golden gecko. Oh, that's. Now you're gonna see some bad crap. Uh, let's try the head. Nice. See? Little gecko was critically hit in the head for 21 hit points. The damaging attack knocks him unconscious. But, of course, we killed him, so that doesn't really matter. Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Come on, Solik. I hope he's going for Solik. Let's see if we can do it. The head only... Uh, it's not good enough. Not good enough, I say. I think he'll go for us now, though, because... Uh, we shot him. Look at the size of that thing. Would you... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that was lucky. That's not good. How many hit points does he have? Oh, still lots. The head. Nice. 23 hit points, tearing some of its slimy skin off. I'm not gonna reload. Oh. Only two hit points? That's strange. I think Solik is gonna finish him off. But I'm not gonna find out. I'm just gonna run. Oh, damn it. They have a lot of action points as well. Solik is not gonna do anything. Nine hit points. Oh, we, we have to reload as well. Never mind. We be having the seven demon bags. Come on, hit someone, Solik. Damn it. The head. No. Just gonna do a single shot. Come on. Damn! That's not good! Uh, they can knock you down as well, which is not nice. Ah, oh, another one! No! Oh, shite! I'm in trouble. Yeah, I said don't accept this mission if you can't do it. I mean, the worst thing that can happen is you'll lose it, but... How many hit points? One hit point. I'm just gonna punch him, I think. 35! I'm not gonna punch him. How much to shoot? Come on, 95. Nice. Oh. I. Oh, another gecko! No! It's just a change of action now. You know what? Let's run. Let's run and we'll come back. Come on. I hate this play, that's why I hate it. And what's more, I didn't want to kill most of these, because uh, when you get the skill to actually skin them, you can get some money off it, but if they're already dead, you don't get it. Right, there we go. <clears throat> right. Reload. Now, I don't want to be using my first aid and doctor too much, because time will advance. And that's the problem with that. So it's 9 in the morning. It's still 9 in the morning, and now it's 10. Oh, it's just one hour it advances. That's not t too bad. You're too tired. Okay. Nice. Excellent. Alright, so we're 18, 18. That's not too bad. Let's go back. Maybe I could use one more healing powder, but... Not for now. I think we're gonna go straight to combat here. Yes, we will. They're still still here. Bloody geckos. 64 in the head. Let's try it. Let's be stupid. Yeah! 29 hit points! Yeah! <laughs> you see, that's because we got one more perception or something. <laughs> I was just lucky. The head. Come on. Damn! <laughs> Oops, little gecko was hit instead of golden gecko, but that's not good. I mean, that doesn't help us, it's because this guy was hit and he's already dead, so... Oh, nice. Come on, Solik, you can do this. Come on. Ow! Bloody bastard. That's such an awesome reload sound. Now Solik can do something. Come on, Solik. Finish. Come on, Solik! What the hell are you doing? <sighs> Bloody stupid idiot. The head. Come on. Nice. What? Didn't crit. 
Oh. That's gonna be horrible! Okay, not too bad. But now I'm surrounded by geckos. Get away from these stupid creatures. Oh, Sulik is just... I think I know what the problem is. I don't want to get that guy to attack me now. I think I... No, I didn't want to go out. Ah, oh, for Pete's sake. I think I know what the problem is. I told him to stay close to me, so... What you uh, mean? Let's do this. <clears throat> no, not this. Talk. No, no, that was okay. Combat control. And then custom. Distance. Uh, charge, I guess, even though that's not really good in situations, because he just goes around killing people like crazy. Right. And then you get into even more trouble. Alright, <clears throat> that's it for now. Let's try this again, bastard. Oh! We don't actually have to fight them now. Golden Gecko, he's still hurt. But, look at all this mess here. No, there's a Golden Gecko here, I don't want to fight that one. Is there anything else here? No. Oh, there's a door on that side, okay. No, 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 he's gonna aggro! Bloody bastard. Oh, well, I can take this one. 83. Oh, 29 hit points. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah. Knocking the stuffing out of it. How many hit points does he have left? 16. How about we do a nice little shot in the head? Bang, and we missed. No, we didn't. We did nine hit points of damage, but uh, not enough. And he's still moving. And he's dead. No? Seriously? I thought he had... Oh, two more. Can we uh, just punch him? 35. Not really. Yeah, not really. Let's just shoot him. Be done with it. <laughs> Excellent. Now, the thing about having a weapon equipped... It's annoying. Whenever you try to use something, he'll holster the weapon, then use the item, you know, the doors, and then unholster the weapon again. So just, you know, select your punch or whatever. Because otherwise it's really annoying. There's some boost here, and that's what we need here. The firewood. And there's the still. You see a distilling device. It looks operational, so let's use the wood in it. <clears throat> there we go. It sounds as though the hooch is distil distilling nicely now. You gain 100 experience points for refueling the still. And you gain 10 karma. Some more booze there. There's some more... Who's there? There's some more wood. I'm not really sure if that's useful or not. Maybe we can add even more booze or something. Uh, I mean, even more firewood. I don't know. I can actually try. Save first, of course, so I don't spoil my progress here. Let's see. I think it's just gonna say it doesn't need any more firewood. Yeah, there's no more room in the still for wood. So let's just drop it. <coughs> All right, and back we go. That was a successful mission. A bit hectic here with all the geckos and golden geckos and all that stuff. There's one there, and now we're gonna go into combat. Let's just strike. Uh, Pete's sake. I just want to get away, stupid geckos. And now the golden one is gonna come from over there as well. No, he's not, because we have higher sequence. All right, let's go back. What are you looking at? Again, it's one of those brothers. Now let's go talk to this guy. Your hooch is safe. Well, thanks for refueling my still for me. Here's your fifty dollars too. Got any questions that I can answer for you? Uh, yes. Tell me what's going on in town lately. All sorts of things going on here about lately. We got Brahmin mutilators, walking spirits, gigantical rats, and missing people. Some even say that Dan's involved. Tell me about the walking spirits. There's a canyon just to the west. <laughs> Metal canyon. There's a canyon just to the west of town that had a bright light in it a few months back. Ever since, every now and then, there's been a horrible squealing sound that comes from the canyon. Brahmin that wander in don't come back. Everyone's afraid to get too near. Now this is the part of the story I was talking about. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, surely a sign of spirit infestation. If only you had a competent shaman. <laughs> Tell me about something else. <clears throat> a den. What kind of den? Not a den, THE den. You'll not find a greater harvest common villainy. 
Now, where did I hear that? In any case, it's a rough sort of place a few days travel south of here, uh, south of Klamath. Anything can be had there for a price, even slaves. But you have to be very careful there. Lots of short tempers attached to dangerous weapons. I don't think they have much to do with this, though we're too poor here. I think I'd be safe enough there. I know how to handle myself. Missing people? Tell me more. Lately we've had a couple of people go missing. A trader named Vic who specialized in pre-war stuff and one of our best trappers. Tell me about the trader some call Vic. Well, Vic was quite a fella. He didn't like to work too much, so he would specialize in expensive pre-war things and then go sell them to the den. Or even hog them to stupid tribals as religious artifacts. <laughs> Oops, no offense. Anyway, I haven't seen him for a while. Last, last I heard, uh, he went south to sell some stuff. Maybe to the den. What about the missing trapper? The real person to tell you about the missing trapper would be Mrs. Buckner. She and Smiley were pretty close. He went north to look for the cave of the golden geckos and hasn't been since. Uh, he, uh, hasn't been seen since. That was a while back, too. Hmm, interesting. I need to ask you about something else. Have you ever heard of something called a Garden of Eden creation kit? A Garden of Eden creation kit? Why, I think I saw one of those listed on a page of one old catalog I was looking through while I was sitting down out back. But I don't know much more about it than that. Really? I like to see that catalog. Uh, I kind of use that page to take care of some business, if you know what I mean. <laughs> business? Oh, that kind of business? I prefer old newspaper myself. Oh, well, tell me something else then. <clears throat> I don't think I need to listen to all of that right now. How rude. Well, mister, maybe I'll be seeing you around here later. Bye. <clears throat> all right, so that was quite helpful. Now, actually, are we... We're still only like that kind of sucks. Well, let me try to barter. Let me try to barter. <laughs> if I can get some good stuff, how much for this? Yeah, see, this is a more reasonable, a reasonable price. It's still a lot, but you know, I'll just, I'll just have some money. See, excuse me. Now the problem is, you know, see my um. Uh, scroll wheel works, but only on that side. You can't. You have to use the buttons here. So she's got some leather armor, which is fairly nice, but it's really expensive. So I'm just gonna take all of my uh, heavy stuff and hand it over to her. Hmm. Should I sell something else? This maybe 190. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. All right. Thanks. Bye-bye. And now we go to the den. Another place I never really liked. <laughs> but, oh well. You look funny. Oh, shut up. Alright, there's the talk. Oh, no. First we go here, of course. The toxic caves. Oh, that's gonna be tough. That's where Smiley is. What's going on? Oh, no, no. Random encounter. A band of angry outcasts. No, I don't want to encounter those. And it's night time, so I'm just gonna go around a little bit to wait for daylight. Don't want to click on the triangle. Oh. Now this place is not very nice. There's lots of toxic goo, there's lots of geckos and golden geckos. And yeah. You feel very nauseous. What? Why? What am I doing? Was I poisoned or something? Anyway, um, you have entered the toxic caves. How much to shoot this one? 66 in the head. Yeah. 12 only. Nice. Grampy Bone be telling us to kill and then be killing again. Now don't hit Solik. How many hit points does he have? Yeah, okay. Nice. Let me just check how many bullets I have left for this. 52, not too bad, I guess. Have to save here, though. This place is dangerous. And, um... I'm gonna try and avoid as many geckos as I can. It's not gonna be easy, though. Not gonna be easy at all. 51 for the hand. I'm gonna miss, aren't I? Yes, I am. Yeah, I'm not even gonna try... 
I need to get my guns up first. And it's dark in here, so. Ooh, so cool. Whatever that means. Alright. There's a golden gecko here, golden gecko there, golden gecko there. Uh, and they're all gonna come over here. Now the, the other problem is... We need to have these things equipped. The rubber boots. An old pair of sturdy rubber work boots. And also give some to Solik. What you be needing? Because uh, otherwise this goo is gonna burn us. And the problem is, it's gonna burn through the damn boots. So we're gonna have a problem. Right. I could try sneaking past, but I don't really think... It Oh, there we go. As soon as I start sneaking, this guy comes out. <laughs> wants to buy my, bite my head off. Critical hit, please? No, it wasn't a critical hit, damn it. And the other one's coming. As you can see, they're avoiding the goo. So this is gonna be... And I missed. Bloody hell. Nice one. You really need solid here, because this... Yeah, ow. The thing is, they can also knock you down, which is really crappy. Oh, come on, stop missing! Crampy bone can taste your fear! Ow, ow! Ow! Come on, guys! Can I do a bloody aim shot? Come on! Nice! 43 hit points! The damaging attack knocks him unconscious. That's what I'm talking about. See, the problem is, they have so many attacks. Come on. Nice. Only 5 hit points. Damn it. The pain come on you now, man. He's not a man, he's a gecko. See, only after these couple of geckos, I'll have to heal up. Only 10 hit points. See, the eyes is what I usually go for, but we don't really have... You know, 47%. I could try, but yeah, we're just gonna miss. Because Murphy is always with me. And that means if it's uh, 47%, we always will miss. How many hit points does he have? 18. Come on. Come on. Nice. 32 hit points. And we're gonna run out of ammunition. 42, well, maybe not. So what I'm gonna do is just go over here. And run around a little bit to heal up. <laughs> 23, yeah, that's not too good. Let's try a... Uh, fail to do any healing. Three hit points. Fail. Four hit points. Come on. Come on. There we go. Three hit points. Maybe a doctor's kill as well. No. Ah, never mind. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Four hit points. That's not too bad. There's another one here. What? I thought that was something moving over here. That scared the crap out of me. Well, not really, but that scared me. <laughs> that was weird. Okay. Anyway, don't step on the goo too much. Can we actually get to this little place? Mm. I want to get over there. We have boots, but we shouldn't really walk over this stupid stuff too much. Because it'll burn through them and that'll be it. Oh, that was worth it. That was worth it. I will say that was worth it. Come on. Right, let's try to sneak. Let's try to sneak. It's not gonna work. We'll never go past this guy. There we go. <laughs> Why do I even bother? Come on, Solik, help me. The head. Nice! 20 hit points and he's unconscious. Perfect. Oh, he's still unconscious, though. So we're just gonna finish him off. Actually, I don't want to waste bullets. I'm just gonna punch him to death. Ah! I've got boots equipped. Come on, strong punch. No, I, I want to finish him off. <laughs> Poor thing. 
There we go. Poor thing. Alright, that was pretty good though. Alright, and now we descend into the lower parts. Oh god. Which are so much more horrible. Oh, I don't want to go this way. Hello, Gecko. He's right there in my face, the head. Yeah. Nice! This one is unconscious as well. It's awesome. Alright, same thing as before, Solik. Let's take it out. <laughs> mm. Yeah! Mm. Yeah, Solik, go for it. I want to stay in combat. There we go. Wow. That's um, a little easier than what I remember. But I am being lucky with uh, knocking them unconscious. That's pretty awesome. Now let's go over here. Initiate common. Let's see. Can we gauge? There's one here. One there. One there. There's probably one there as well. Hmm. Huh. I think that's the entrance. I'm not sure. What the hell is this? Train. You can barely make out some movement behind the grate covering this drain. You can see small red eyes peering back at you. Rat eyes. <laughs> right, I guess we're gonna go up this way. Because I only saw one golden gecko here. Where are you? There you are. A little too far away for an aim shot, aren't you? Yeah. See, if it's like this, then you have absolutely no chance of hitting the eyes. So, 51, just come closer. I'm gonna stay away a little bit so he doesn't hit me in this turn. There you go. There you go. Come on. Nice, but it was not a crit, damn it. Ooh, that was nice. Knocking the stuffing out of it. Come on. That was not a crit. Damn it. Ow. I cannot afford this. Come on. Nice. 21. See, this is why I like building a sniper character in Fallout 2. You can just do inc stupid amounts of damage if you aim for the eyes and such. You know, you can even blind them, so they're much less useful in combats and so on. It's it's pretty crazy. Oh, there's two golden geckos here, and another one there. Oh, bloody hell. It never ends, they just keep coming. 55, I'm... Nice. Very nice. And he's still far away that he won't hit me. 43, hmm. Nice. 21 hit points, staring some of its slimy skin off. We got the power now. How many hit points does he have? 12. Yeah, let's try going for the head. That was not a hit. Um, critical hit. And yeah, we've got boots in the other. Oh. Come on, Solik, finish him off. Aw, oh, damn. Ow! See, that's the problem. And now we had to use some uh, action points. I think it was two to get back up. Let's just finish him off. Damn it. That's not too good. Oh yeah, these things. These are red X. Anti-radiation cams to be taken before exposure. No known side effects. Yeah, that's uh, reassuring. So, now we have to guess. Either we're gonna have to heal up. Or just go for it. But we're gonna do this next time. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.